calm does not suit us. We're born for the storm. The day itself was, you know, it was terrifying. I, I recall looking at uh, Sergeant Cox and he was like, yo, we gotta get up there and help. That's the, that's the first thing that he said. A whole lot of emotions come from it, from the day it happened till today. You know, it's just always goes through my mind. I think about it weekly, daily, just. There's a sense of pride that comes with receiving the award, but also it's not why I did what I did. I didn't do it because I wanted an award. I didn't do it to even be recognized. I did it because I was able to, and that's what you should do. As just a decent human being, you should help if you can. You never know how you're gonna react in those situations, but definitely having Mike there with me made my decision to react so so quickly, uh, very easy. Uh, I'm not gonna lie, I was, I was scared. And then seeing that initial reaction from everyone around you running away from it, and the first thing that he says, being my junior, yo, we gotta get up there. I'm like, all right, well, if he's going, I'm going. Him being there tre helped tremendously. And I'm glad that it happened to be my, like my best friend. I don't know, it's just being instilled in you from the, from the get-go. I mean, as soon as you step on them yellow footprints, that's just your whole mindset, I think, changes. And every day as a Marine, I think that you, you need to challenge yourself and find your purpose. And that day just happened to be my purpose was to help others. And I think going back from the training from day one has just helped me get through all that, that event and everything. Fate whispers to the warrior, you cannot withstand the storm. The warrior whispers, I am the storm.